EIE Instruments Private Limited Presence Method to find out impact value of aggregate as per IS 2386 Part 4 Introduction Toughness is the property of material to resist impact. The aggregate may break into smaller pieces. During the construction process of pavement layers, when heavy roller pass over it or by movement of heavy vehicle load of traffic. The stone aggregate should therefore be sufficiently strong to resist fracture under impact loads. Aggregate impact test has been designed to evaluate the toughness of the aggregates to breaking down under repeated application of impact. Apparatus The apparatus consists of an impact testing machine, a cylindrical metal measure, a tamping rod, IS test sieve, weighing balance and hot air oven. Impact testing machine The aggregate impact test machine consists of a strong metal base, a detachable cylindrical steel cup of internal diameter of 102 mm and depth 50 mm centrally fitted on the base. A metal rammer weighing between 13.5 to 14 kilograms having lower end 100 mm in diameter and 50 mm in length which is sliding freely on vertical guides. There is an arrangement for raising the hammer and allowing it to fall freely over the cup filled with the sample from a height of 380 mm above the top surface of the specimen. The height of fall can be adjusted up to 5 mm. A key is provided to support the rammer in rest position. A machine is also fitted with blow counter to measure the impact strokes on the specimen. Measure A cylindrical metal measure having internal diameter of 75 mm and depth 50 mm for measuring aggregates. Tamping rod 10 mm in diameter and 230 mm long rounded at one end. Test seal of aperture size 12.5 mm, 10 mm and 2.36 mm. Weighing balance of 5 kg capacity with least count of 0.1 gram. Hot air oven to control 100 to 110 degrees Celsius temperature for sample drying. Procedure The test sample consists of aggregates passing through 12.5 mm sieve and retained on 10 mm sieve is collected. The aggregates is dried in the oven for 4 hours at the temperature of 100 to 110 degrees Celsius and thereafter cooled in room atmosphere. The aggregates are filled up to about one third in the measure and gently tamped for 25 strokes with the help of rounded end of the tamping rod. Further, similar quantity of aggregates is then added up to about two-third in cylinder and 25 strokes of tamping rod are given. Finally, the measure is filled with the aggregates to overflow and tamped for 25 strokes. The surplus aggregates are struck of using the tamping rod as straight edge. The net weight of the aggregate is determined to nearest gram. This weight is also used for carrying out the duplicate test. The cup is fixed firmly in position on the base of the machine and the whole sample from the measure is transferred to the cup and compacted by tamping rod with 25 strokes. The hammer is raised until its lower face is 380 mm above the surface of the aggregates in the cup and allowed to fall freely on the aggregates. The sample is subjected to a total of 15 such blows of the hammer. 
each blow being delivered at an interval of not less than one second. Also, the blows are recorded in the blow counter. The crushed aggregates is then removed from the cup and whole sample is passed through 2.36 mm sieve. The fraction passing this sieve is weighed accurate to 0.1 gram. The fraction retained on the sieve is also weighed and the total of fraction passing and retained on the sieve should not be less than the original weight of the specimen by more than 1 gram. If the total weight is less than the original by over 1 gram, the result should be discarded and fresh test should be carried out. This test is repeated with the same test sample and same weight as in the first test. Calculation Let the original of the oven dried sample in cylindrical measure is equal to W1 gram and broken aggregates passing through 2.36 mm after 15 blows is equal to W2 grams. Then, aggregate impact value that is AIV is equal to W2 upon W1 multiplied by 100. This is recorded correct to the first decimal point. Results The mean of the two test result is reported as the aggregate impact value of the specimen. Aggregate impact value are used to classify the stone aggregates with respect to toughness property as per the table. Thank you. Wishing you an accurate testing. Please visit us at www.eieinstruments.com.